Hi folks, Robert here with more Rim Training, and if you're not familiar with this channel, uh, we do training for Rhythm Basics, and please subscribe, share, uh, help to support this channel so we can make training videos like this a lot. So this is a part of one of my series, uh, The Warehouse. So we're going to focus on link models. So we have actually three link models here, and we're going to do this raw and rivet, whereas... Um, you know, you got collaboration tools and uh, cloud and 360. So this is a method we want to use by just using link models. So here, in my project browser here, at the bottom here where it said River Link, these are my three links. The models here, I have a systems model, electrical model, and structural. So I might want to just go and do a little, let me see, I want to select the roof. So I want to hide this roof. So you can see our structure there. So I'm hiding that. I just go into the temporary hide and I'll just hide the element. So now you can see there's pretty much our structure so like you can go ahead and I would say, I would right click here. You can do this here or you can do this in the manage tab. I would right click here and I would say, um, unload. Okay. So all of my structure is gone now. And then that structure is in another file. So, uh, I can go in and I can look here. It's my electrical here where it says cables tray and everything. So what I'll do here, I'm going to go and I want to just here, you can select this. Well, let's just remove everything for now just to show you this. So electrical, I can do the same thing. <coughs> Excuse me. You can do the same thing here. Now load. So the electrical is gone. I don't know why. That's probably, or the elect I don't know why the light fixtures are still there. Probably because they are detector elements. So I'm going to right click here, and I'm going to uh, reload. Takes a minute. Right click here, and reload. That's doing the upgrade. I don't know. I think uh, this is an old file. I'm sure you folks seen it. We do our structure and our, uh, architecture here. So what I'm going to do now, once this keeps doing this thing, doing I don't know why it's doing this. Plus upgrading. <laughs> so now here. Wow, it took all day just to do that, just to hide the rough, okay. Oh, probably because, nope, no excuses there, it should have been that long. So there's our, this is in the architecture file, we see every all of our elements, and there in the project browser, as you see here, it says everything that it's on. So now what I wanna do, I'm gonna leave this file here, I'm going to just go here and I'm going to go reset it, bring the roof back. And I'm going to go into one of these link models just to show you, just for one of them. So I'm going to uh, close these here. Uh, I'm going to say no for now. Probably should have said yes. I don't know. So now what I want to do, I want to go and open up the uh, electrical model for this. Hmm. Don't know why it's upgraded. Thought I saved these. Sorry. But... Uh, <clears throat> hmm. 
Okay, I might pause this for a second while this is doing this thing. Oh boy. Uh, okay, so what's going on here is this is upgrading the file from 2013 because it's an older file. That's why it's taking so much time here. Sorry. So what I'm going to do, I might just cancel this out. Because we kind of know what's going on here. Uh, okay. Yep. Sooner or later. It'll have to happen. Wow. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to leave it here. Because I didn't know I expect this to happen. I'm gonna, okay. Close this. Gosh, man. Huh, damn. So this is the electrical here. And we got cable trays and everything. And then here, as you can see, we have the architecture model link. Well, we have it shut off here. Interesting, maybe. But I'm going to turn it on. I'm going to reload it. Uh-oh, so we got a little issue here. Something's wrong with these models. Uh, so that's the, not a good thing. So I'm going to undo that. And like I said, I'm going to leave it here. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, just wanted to show you how the link models work in Revit. Uh, I think I might want to just, just go through that and see how it goes. Because, like I said... There's an issue here. I don't know what's going on with this model. So if I reload it, you see what happens. But anyway, guys, uh, yeah, something's going on with this model here in Alaska. So anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Uh, please subscribe. Uh, that's you make videos like this all the time. Thanks, y'all. Bye. Be safe.